I, I met Kinko in a, uh, it was a, I think it was a Malcolm X rally, or no, wait a minute, it was, it was, uh, I, I actually can't quite really remember where it was, but Kinko, he really touched me, uh, but, but I didn't press any charges, and that was fine, because I actually, I kind of enjoyed it, but really, I, it may not have, it may have been my imagination, but anyway, Kinko was really the sort of guy that, um, well, he's actually kind of disturbing, but, but in, in the same sense, he, he, I find uh, the other presidents that we have had to be, to be equally disturbing in, in, a, in a really, uh, you know, more of a homicidal sort of way. So I, I think that, uh, uh, quite frankly, he's, I mean, you know, how, how, much, how much worse can it be? So really, uh, I, I think that maybe Kinko is, uh, you know, he's the least unnerving of the candidates that you could possibly have, even though he has really... No, no particular credentials that would lead you to believe that he has any capacity to run, uh, uh, you know, a small pizza shop, let alone uh, maybe even you know one of the, the, one of the largest entities in the in the history of the world. But even so, I think he he deserves your full support to be able to uh, follow through with uh, the, the the responsibilities uh, that nobody else has done any good decent of a job following through with in the past. I don't know, 50, forever, pretty much. Uh, so vote for him, really, please, uh, honestly. I, I, I think I'm getting sick. Can I please stop this now?